Hey guys, today's on schizophrenia and trigger management. Schizophrenia and trigger management. But before we get to this, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I've conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm not a spring chicken. I swear, I'm not a spring chicken. I'm not a spring chicken. And I've been around a few preludes in my years. And I'm telling you, this kid, this prelude, it's got something. It's particularly luxurious. Kind of like a... Uh, Hmm, what do you got under the sun that's luxurious today? You got something? Cannoli. Holy cannoli. Hello there, my name is Robert Francis. It's a You've very, my very luxurious bakery item. Where me and the bird. The cannoli. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. Gosh, they're good, aren't they? This cannoli. This is the cut of my jib right here for reasons of this my book medical right confidentiality. Here, no, no bird flying, just a book on the cover. I'm a licensed social worker times 15 years. You're lost in the woods that's and you're looking for... Chatting. Schizophrenia. I've been diagnosed with this schizophrenia right for a score five and one. It's the math. And that puts a little gray flag in my beard. Holy cannoli. Thank you for joining me on my channel. I'm now not. to topic. I'm not a spring to topic, chicken. To topic. I'm not a spring chicken. Trigger management is when the rubber meets the road. We got to get really, really good at managing our triggers. When you're triggered over the course of the day, be it a delusion or a voice or something disturbing. Managing that trigger uh, while it happens in time over the moments that the trigger occurs and over the next 15, 20 minutes is crucial. Uh, we have to be an expert at trigger management. And the better that you get with managing your acute triggers, the better the long-term outcome is going to be. And once you get uh, skilled at managing your triggers, then a lot of progress can be made. So. Make sure you uh, you focus on your trigger management. And make sure that when you're triggered, you, uh, you your coping mechanisms flood your mind and uh, activate and uh, take care of the trigger. Let it go, cope with it, let it pass, and then forget about it. So acute trigger management is crucial, very very crucial for our long term ability. And if you learn to acutely manage your triggers, then it, you, you develop a certain sort of confidence about managing the illness in the whole. So an Italian cannoli, holy cow, delicious, delicious. I don't, I don't know what if some fried, fried uh, outside layer with like a cream cheese blend in the middle. I love all Italian food, cannolis included. Cannoli, have a cannoli, cannolis are great. I could go for a cannoli. I need a sweet right now. I have a sweet tooth right now. I'm off to get a cannoli. I'll be back uh, tomorrow and uh, see you then on the Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Thanks, guys.